thank you very much. We do appreciate that very much. This group has worked very hard the last 13 weeks of school. I am extremely proud of what they've done and everything else. You know, we're going to have a great band. We have great bands now, but, you know, large numbers. Uh, one of the things we're actually having to do is we're actually having to buy additional uniforms for us looking ahead two years from now because we have just enough for this group over here and then the following year we'll need some more for these folks. So uh, a lot of you who helped out with the fruit sale this year, I do appreciate that as do the students because it benefits the band directly and uh, some of that money is going to be starting to apply to getting those uniforms. It's going to cost us not too bad, we're going to need about $10,000 and we have quite a bit of it already for those uniforms. If anybody does still have fruit to pick up, uh, they're over there right now at the Joe building until 9 o'clock tonight. If anyone would like to have additional fruit, we still have everything except tangelos and grapefruit. Uh, so we did order a ton of extra oranges. So if you would like to do that, uh, Joe Brioco and several other parents I think are over there until 9 o'clock tonight. Thompson, Jennifer Thompson, I'll forget that. And, uh, They'll, they'll help you out with that, and that money does go directly to help us out. Everything you see here that's school-owned, those are past fruit sales over the many, many years that we've been doing this, so we do thank you for that. Okay? Um, I'd also like to make a note at this time, I'd like to thank Daniel Riggins, she's our assistant band director, she's actually the choir teacher here, she helps out for everything after school, and I do greatly appreciate all the help that she helped us through the year, because with this large number of students and moving them around, and when we do four festival parades and stuff like that, an extra set of eyes and hands helping out get the students where they need to be is wonderful. So I do thank you, Danielle, for all the help. I'd also like to thank Mr. Carr for helping out getting the chairs out for some of you to have a seat tonight. Um, next Tuesday, uh, the choir department and the uh, theater department, actually, eighth grade choir, are going to be doing a musical. We've got actually a musical theater here at the middle school. There'll be a spring musical also happening. But next Tuesday, December 18th, in the cafeteria, we're going to be doing Yes, Virginia, the musical. And we invite you out. It's at 7.30. It should be a great show. We're going to do a little change here where we have to flip our, our students. And now we'll do a quick warm up to South Grant because I've been standing there very patiently. And I thank you guys so we can get them warmed up. And I do encourage you. I know there are a lot of people here. A couple of people at basketball practice. I know they have to run to. But I really do really emphasize I like my students to stay and watch the other bands. I think that's extremely important for us to see the progression. And hopefully seventh grade you can live up to that, right? Because they are better than they were last year. They were really good last year too. So I thank you again. We'll get these guys moved around.